first call. Henry? Mm, you go, Bernard. I don't want to. Well, I don't want to either. I don't want to at all. There are no accidents. Then may I stay on your way home? I hope you will yourself over an embankment. Go on. Call up Peter Dahlbeck. I mean, that's who you'd like to call, isn't it? Who's Peter Dahlbeck? It's the boy in Detroit whose family Bernard's mother has been a laundress for. I used to work for them. After school and every summer, I think I've loved him all my life. But he was never aware that I was laughing besides his straight. So nothing ever happened between you? Uh, they finally made it in the pool house one night after a drunken swimming party. With the right wine and the right music, there are damn few that I'm curious. <laughs> now afterwards, we went swimming in the nude, in the dark, with only the moon reflecting on the water. <laughs> How romantic. And then the next morning, you took him his coffee and an alka seltzer on a tray. It was afternoon. And I remember I was worried sick about having to face him in the morning. But he just pretended like nothing at all happened. <laughs> Christ, he must have been so drunk last night he didn't remember anything. Oh, sure, Nate. <laughs> Odd how that works. And now, for ten points, get that liar on the phone. 